Hello everyone, how are you today? This is Mark. So, I've decided to give you another mini lesson. To begin with, let me just talk about a point in grammar that you'll find very useful when having a conversation with someone. In this lesson, I'll talk about this course markers. These course markers are words like uh, to begin with, so, right, etc. that are used at, at the start of a conversation or at the end of a conversation. Thus, we use them to connect, to manage, organize what we say or write and sometimes to express attitude. So let's just look at my two introductory examples. So I've decided to give you another mini lesson. So in this case is the discourse marker. So it's used when we want to introduce a new thought, a new idea. Okay. So my second example was to begin with, let me just talk about a point in grammar that you'll find useful when having a conversation with someone. In this case, to begin with, is the discourse marker. And uh, we use this expression at the beginning of uh, a new idea. Okay, so it, to introduce a new idea. Let's just look at other examples uh, with uh, an informal dialogue. The discourse markers are in pink. Hey, what are you doing this weekend? Well, I don't actually have any plans. How about you? You see, I was wondering if you wanted to join us for lunch. Sure, I like that. Great, that's a plan then. Be at my place at midday. See you then. You bet. We use hey to get the attention of the listener. Well, is used at the start of what we want to say and to introduce a remark. Actually, here is used to show contrast. You see, is used to share knowledge with a listener. Sure, is used to show agreement. Great is used to express enthusiasm. You bet is used to emphasize a statement. As you can see from the dialogue, these course markers are very important to show our feelings towards a statement in a dialogue, obviously. But um, these course markers can also be used in these situations. To say something in another way, to change topic, to start a conversation, to end a conversation, to share knowledge, to give an answer, to show attitude, and to sound less direct. Let's just list other discourse markers. Mind you, for a start, moreover, on the other hand, anyway, firstly, and in general, to sum up, I mean, you know, got it, etc, etc. So now, let's recap. Discourse markers are words like right, okay, to begin with, etc. that are used at the beginning of a conversation or to end a conversation. Thus, we use them to connect, to manage, to organize what we say or write, and sometimes to express feelings, obviously. Anyway, that's all this time. Actually, why don't you write a sentence under this video with a discourse marker, one or two discourse markers. I hope you enjoyed the lesson, and I see you next time. Have a great day, and don't forget to share. Bye-bye.